Welcome back, attractive and well-educated watchers, to Kenshi. Welcome to a brand new series. So, since the Betsy crash and all that stuff, a bunch of updates have happened, and it's taken a while for us to just get back into the game, just in the general sense. Now, that's fine. We are going to have to start over anyway, because some of the mods that we were uh, using back in the day are just not there anymore. They're completely outdated, they're obsolete, they can't be used. So, uh, now... What we're doing is we're playing with new mods. Actually, quite a few new mods. It's pretty cool and pretty pretty uh, exciting. But but this time, oh yeah, we've got a special mod, Heroic Beginnings. Now that particular now that particular mod includes a beginning. Well, it just includes high stat beginnings, like Holy Nation Citizen, things like that. But we're going for a particular beginning that comes with it called Hero. If we can get to that. Somewhere in here. And the Hero is probably one of our favorite kinds of game start. Uh, not the Tech Hunter. Tech Hunter also comes from that same one. Fun fact. Uh, this one, the hero. You were suddenly transported into an unfamiliar world. You know not what you are, nor what you must do, but you would feel empowered and powerful as you take in your foreign surroundings, items, armor, and sponta weapons spontaneously materialize on you while your own clothes and items disappear. You are not shaken by this. Instead, you are courageous for the journey ahead. You set off to explore this new world knowing things you could have not known before. For that's what we're gonna do because of course you, you know a lot of people try to run you know super hard mode obviously hannibal senpai already has like uh, a rock bottom beginning in hannibal show with brewing heights and we're a super big fan of that because our last game actually was in the exact same place as brewing heights with an entirely different layout uh this time around we just want to go completely different we want to do the hero we want to be a super powerful guy who runs around and protects people, and in theory takes over cities, but we don't know. We'll see. Um, we, we have the Take Over the World mod on this, so we, we might be able to take over cities at some point, but that won't be for a bit. For many, many episodes yet. So, we're going to start this, and because we wanted our God Hand Chosen One to be a very certain special character before, uh, we're just going to import that character build right in as soon as it loads. Load. Load. Ooh, heads. All right, here we go. Uh, we're definitely not going to name her Alfonso. We're going to name her Sue Keola Gray, because that's how we roll. Now, for those who don't remember Sue, look at her. She's so irritated at the whole entire world. Look at her face. She only has... She's very even-tempered. She's always... She... she Very even-tempered. Always angry. Yeah. <laughs> Just always ready to kick your ass. Um, we, we're not going to be altering anything on her. This is who she is and what she is in the import menu. This is what her awesome gear is going to be. Honestly, we really wanted her to be martial arts, but the, the hero beginning starts with good martial arts anyway. Uh, we want to slap the creators for having a back-mounted longsword. You can't do that. You literally can't do that. Go ahead, put a normal sword. Not even, like, a sword that's as big as you. Just a normal sword on your back, like, that's, like, this long. And then try to try to pull that off, like, straight. Your arm literally isn't long enough to do that. There is absolutely no historicity or even effectiveness to it. <laughs> you can put other things on your back, like a backpack or something like that. Uh, that being said, we're just going to let it slide. We're here to have fun. I mean, look at these giant horn thingies. That's, that's not going to help anybody in a fight. That might keep you from even walking into a door if you're trying to raid the village. So we're just going to let that slide for now. We have, we, we've set our piece. <clears throat> we're in Ocran's Pride. Okay, well, this isn't so bad. This is where we dropped into. This actually isn't a horrible place to just, like, drop into as some random... We're going to say she's modern because we love doing that kind of stuff. 
we we love you know dropping a modern person in we're we're so powerful she's just a modern girl who was living her life and then bam superpowers apparently she just does not have good perception but that's fine that that's a very underutilized ability in this game nobody cares about it uh certainly is able to kill things with great efficiency and proficiency probably would be able to beat you up too but for now we're gonna roll around with a sword because a sword is what we get whoa going super fast let's look at where we are uh bad teeth blister hill i mean okay it's not so bad let's let's go to bad teeth because that isn't a weird unwelcoming name or anything let's look at our well we're running along let's the edge of the universe a weapon of unknown origins with lethal power to slice the fabric of space itself there are strange glowing inscriptions on them that you know somehow to mean god slayer the origin of these artifacts however are unknown the unknown weapon that hums with deadly power it may slash even time itself oh that's pretty cool where are we are we around bad teeth now no, we totally aren't. We're just kind of chilling around. That's fine. We can look at the rest of our thing. Because we've got a, a spatial rucksack. Space is warped within this pack. It appears to hold more than it can. Nice. It is worth five million. Although, we would sell it for half that. Except that we won't sell that at all. Look at this thing. Uh, that's great. Cumbrance reduction, 100%. We have a lantern. Not special. It's, it's just a lantern. It's it's nothing fancy. Yeah. <laughs> Blade of Infinity. Edge of the Universe. Immortal Male. Tunic for the One. So this is the Chosen One. Greaves for the One. Apocalypse Greaves. Flash Steps. Nice. Aegis. Alright, alright. Well, we are Japanese, so they didn't have shields anyway. And the crown of eternity. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Super exciting. Alright, alright. Let's close this thing. It's, it's taking up a bit too much space. So, where are we going to go here? Is that a... Oh. Okay. This is a pretty nice view here. We really do just want to go that way, though, if that's okay. Go, Sue, go. She's our master of overkill. Nobody can st take that away from her. Some people really wish they could take that away from her, but it, it's just not going to fly. She's already got it. There's, there's nothing to stop her. All right, let's go in here with these sexist, racist, authoritarian peoples. Hey, high paladin. Don't get divine blessings. Just right, we're human. We forgot. It's like being white. You can, if you're, if you're a human, you can just wander on in, and they'll totally let you pass. They won't question a damn thing as long as you don't have a weird mechanical arm or whatever. And we we just look like a really cool samurai, and they they don't they've got samurai of their own. They don't have any any reason to blink an eye at that. Uh, general store, long house, power station, weapon shop, mechanical shop, armory, barracks, uh, a little house for sale. We're not really looking to set up roots here. Uh, HQ. Will they attack us if we come in? Yeah, they will attack us. Okay, let's not. I mean, it's not like we couldn't. All right, all right, bro. All right, bro. We're we're out. We're we're left. We we have left. Silly paladin. Armor shop. For what would we need an armor shop? Oh, jeez, the Phoenix Lord. 
Like Phoenix Lord Ozai or whatever. What's this? A longhouse? Just a just a general longhouse? Oh, it goes down into this area. Well let's let's leave this town. It, it's it's kinda lame. Divine blessings, dude. Alright, well as plentiful as this place seems, it's it also seems a little tapped out. So, uh... Oh, what's that? Holy Mines. What's that about? Let's check that out. Swimming in full metal samurai armor. Gonna go swimming, yeah. Swim a little faster to get to the other side. Not gonna drown today. Who? Okay, where are we going? Yeah, find the path. It's a spell that every character in this game needs. Uh, discovering mines, discovering mines. One round, discovering mines. Auckland's Golf. Okay. Uh, there is mineable stuff. Not gonna say anything to us. It's cool, we can just wander on inside or Oh What's this? Work through the Beast is impure, but you can still overcome Narco's darkening. What the hell? Repent for your wicked ways. Uh. Okay, there, buddy. We're, uh. We're not the religious type, so. Guard duty. Oh. Oh. We see what's going on here. Jeez, that's, uh... Oh, jeez, they're not nice about it either. Huh. Yeah, yeah, well, uh... Jeez, that's... That's harsh, man. This is, uh... This is not a great world. You think that's, uh... No, it's just kind of like a natural formation. Jeez, we already don't like this planet. Um, can we not be around the nasty people? How about we just... Uh, Skinner's Rome. Jeez, that doesn't sound so good either. Rebirth? Well, that place can't be so bad. Let's go there. We mean rebirth. That's kind of like what our character had. We were some modern person. Now we're the hero in an unknown land. And let's go over there. Can't be, can't be a bad place. Sounds like new beginnings. We like that. Um, do 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 do. Maybe we'll go a little faster. Oh. Uh, well. Gonna turn on the juice a little here. Yeah, there we go. Zip on past that land. It's pretty much where we started, as we recall. There's some colorful beasts there, wandering around. That was nice. Pretty nice. I mean, as ugly as the people here seem to be, it doesn't seem to be that terrifying of a land. Oh, we're loading. 
surely we will find the way to this rebirth. And, uh, that will be excellent. Yeah, yeah, we did. Oh, uh, uh, is that it? That looks like a, a solid defensive settlement. Yes, we are sure that we are getting close. Oh. Well, that didn't sound ominous at all. We wonder what's here. Hey, uh, nah, nah. Oh, look, simple, friendly guard people. Shed the darkness that rots your core. Oh, dear. Uh, blessings upon you, sister. Okay, okay, we're... So, can we go in? Is that cool? A small shack. The HQ. A barracks. What's all this then? Holy gracious. For real? A giant statue of Ozai? What in goodness gracious is going on here? Can anybody tell us? Is this just one of those things that we'll have to find out by ourselves? Ah, good, a person. Where is your carer? I'll not speak with a woman? Oh, fuck. Are you for real? Okay. Okay. Shoe woman? Oh, man. Super close to a riot. A one-woman riot right here. Come on, son. You don't seriously think you're gonna get away with treating Sue, the master of overkill, like this, do you? We mean, slavery is one thing. It's It's like... You know, we don't really have the power to overthrow an entire culture yet. But if you're going to be rude about it, you know, that's that's another thing entirely that we just uh, cannot, if you know what we mean. Slave shop barracks to... Is there still nobody here who can or will talk to us? Let's go in one of these shops. You know, we're not really interested in buying any slaves or anything, but... Nothing? Nothing. Ho, 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 boy, guys. You are... You are cutting it real close. We'll tell you what. If we don't find somebody... In this God's forsaken place. To talk to. Who treats us like a human. We are going to bust this entire place down. You don't believe us? I mean, that is a big, ugly statue of Ozai. And we have to assume it's anatomically accurate, so... I mean, we'll knock that thing down. We'll knock it over. We will. I mean, goodness, look at it. If you can. Yeah, just walk over. Look at it. It's just asking to be broken apart. Mm. It is very tall, though. Oh, jeez, it is. It's just more. Okay, buddy, we're going to give you one more chance. One more chance to make good. Heretics will be purged by the... Religious nutters. All right. One more chance to tell us what's going on here, buddy. <laughs> All right, buddy. Dead. Dead. 
Oh man, hit him so hard he glitched through the wall. Three people. This guy's like, no, God, let oh jeez, give me away. Uh. That's what you get for being rude. You should respect women more. Seriously. Oh, don't worry, buddy. Oh, we don't forget about you. Mm. Oh, he's losing blood fast. Well, you know, that's... That's what you get for, uh... Tainted Woman. Well, let's just, uh... Oh, jeez, buddy, that leg, it, it doesn't look so good. Man. That's what you get for not respecting women. You don't talk about them like they're property. Was that an arrow? Wah! Hiya! <laughs> those other people? Don't do it, Anakin. We have high ground. See, what did we just say? What did we just say? <laughs> we told them we had the high ground. We told them. They didn't listen. We're just gonna... Oh, should we... You know, we don't have to free the slaves just yet. We can... Let's just run around and cause some havoc first. I mean, there's a lot of guys there still, we bet. We could just cause a good old-fashioned slave riot. Oh, oh, that... That's pretty exciting to think about. Oh, no. We do like good old-fashioned slave riots. <laughs> alright, alright. Nah, nah. Let's, let's be real. We... Oh. Be gone, thought! Oh, we see how it is. Okay, that's... Oh, uh, no, no. Let's get out of here! Yeah, get out of there, buddy. Go, go! Yeah, go, just go! Here, buddy, we'll help you out. Really? Really? Buddy. We killed you, didn't we? Alright, that that's that. We're We're just going down, we're gonna take over the whole place. This festering monument to aristoc aristocratic decadence will remain no longer. Wah! Oh, for the record, we are a super, super criminal right now. And apparently our current bounty is only 6,000? That's kind of lame, guys. Oh, Thief? No, oh, nice! This guy's... This guy's totally getting out. Oh, take him down. Oh. You didn't respect women. <laughs> this is what you get when you go around just enslaving random people and not talking to people based off of their genitalia and stuff. Oh, what are you doing? Are you straight up putting people on stakes? Gracious. Oh, jeez, it's... Are you serious? Okay, that's it. We're... Stay if you want, I'm leaving. See, that person's the smart one. Oh, die. Oh, nice. We are doing an old fa a good old-fashioned slave riot. Yeehaw! Don't worry, buddy, we got your back. Uh, 
uh, take him down. Who was saying bad things about our mom. Oh. Go get him. Get him. <laughs> Die, scum. Go, go. Oh, we got a little friend coming on. Yeah, there you go. Go, buddy, go. Just get out of here, man. Yeah, get out of here. Go, go. Oh, die. Get out of here. Get off of our buddies. Yeah, that's what we're talking about. All right, what do we got here? Nothing? Nothing? All right, let's go bust the slave shops. See, this is what you get for being an ass. We didn't have any problem with all this forced labor until they were starting to be dicks. And that's when you get it, son. That is when Sue doesn't screw around. What you got? Everything? Over here he's bolting. Hey, man. You're the enemy, as far as we're concerned. Nothing there. Doink. Just let everybody out. That's just the kind of person we are. Go, 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 go. Hua. Unlock the shackles. Oh, we are committing all sorts of crime. We are a criminal. Super scary. Yes, you are. Now we suggest you go free. Or alternatively, you could just follow us. That's cool, we guess. We mean, it's not like your only option, but you're definitely welcome to it. Oh, man, you're one of those people, aren't you? Listen, all your masters are dead. We killed them for being rude and sexist. We mean, we're not advocating that you should just kill anybody who's sexist or anything, because that's pretty extreme. But we are saying that, you know, if, if they're gonna kill you, you might as well just stage a riot, you know. <coughs> That's how we do. Let the slaves out. You are slaves no longer, friends. To defy Ocarin is blasphemy? From what we can tell, to defy Ocarin seems pretty natural. What with the fact that you're taking people as slaves and all that nonsense. Oh, you? <laughs> Yes, us. Sinful snake. Jeez, they just. Oh, oh, what's what's what do we got here? 
Oh, oh you aren't going to get away, buddy. We all fall over. All right, random people destined to die. Destiny has a new plan. Don't call us a fool. Yeah, get out of here. Yes, good. This is what a hero does. They bust. Oh no, what are you doing? We're, we are literally keeping you from dying. You idiot. We mean... E awesome. Good. Huh. We seem to be carrying a degree of followers here. Except that one guy who was an idiot and who was like, No, I need to stay. Oh, I can't disobey my masters. Ah. Go. Seriously? Oh, not if you get the heck out of here. Not if there's nobody to beat you. I mean, we've taken care of both of these problems. That's like a thing. All of the problems. Oh, jeez. Here we got another. What are we doing? Where are we going? Away. Does it really matter? It's gonna get killed. Pretty sure... We're going to be just fine. It's you guys who are stuck on stakes and all that. That's, uh... Y'all are going to die. Just just put it out there, guys. You're pretty dumb not, uh, not just getting off those big old poles right now. You know, they, they don't like you. They were just going to kill you anyway. Yeah, if you, uh... If it lets us... How many people do we got? Oh, we totally are just staging a frickin' a frickin' slave riot here, aren't we? And starting frickin' riots. Starting frickin' riots. Are those more slave shops? Yeah, you should, buddy. That's what we would do if we were you. All right, go in. Huh? Die in one shot. Got caught stealing. Who are you snitching? If you're one of you guys in the in the cage is a snitching, we'll just leave you. You know that, right? Don't know how I don't know how I can repay you, but I'll try. See, that's how you do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now do the shackles. See, nobody, nobody just lying around waiting to die. Ooh, we need to get out of here. Words well spoken. You can get out of here if you want. We're going to remain to beat everybody up. Good. Good. No, no. You can leave quickly once again. We can handle these fools. It was not an issue. Like at all. I can't run with these shackles on. Well, how about you? Feel the way it feels without shackles. Man, seriously? Okay. Wish we could have people do this for us. Jeez, we're just busting out all the slaves today. Okay, well, clearly you don't like being free. Yeah, okay. Okay, don't go anywhere. But, you know, they don't like you. They're gonna kill ya. One way or the other. Ooh, buddy, you might just be out of luck. We might be impatient enough just to leave you because your stuff is not working. Yeah, there you go. Okay. 
No leaving you this time. But you're lucky. Bollocks. Oh, jeez, come on, man. How are we going to get the shackles? We're going to get the shackles the same way we got everything else. By picking them. Yeah, yeah, we'll get out of here in due time. Or we won't, alternatively, and we'll just take over this entire place, make it our own, and then tell anybody who comes to attack us that they can go to hell. That's a possibility, too. I mean... I mean, it is a thing. Oh, man, all of them. Each and every one of them. Just, uh, uh. Yes, we can do the shackles, too, good friend. Jeez, all of these people, super eager to die in cages. Too kind for this world? Maybe it's because we don't come from this world, fool. Alright, where are we going? Yeah, do the shackles next. We, we think it's hilarious that there are like five guys so far that just want to stay here. They're not even human. They just actually want to stay here and be worked to death. I mean, we're telling you, man, there, there are better things in your life to do. Like, fight the man, which is what we happen to be doing right now. Unfortunately for these guys in these other slave shops, we're uh, losing a bit of patience. Oh, my goodness. If we destroy the cage, will that make you shut up about it? Yeah, we won't forget the shackles, buddy. You got a proper sense of priorities in order. All right, all right. Slowly, slowly, but surely. Oh, jeez, here we go. Oh. Yes, you are free. You can do whatever you want, but we'd recommend following us because it does not seem like most people are getting out of the gates. That guy is not going home tonight. Uh, apparently. Oh my goodness, work. Already picking the lock there, friend. Good for you. Nice, another stealing from him. Good. Don't know why we did that. Let's just... First aid this fool. Alright. Good. Hey buddy, you don't necessarily want to do that. Just warning you. But we do. Die! Two people at once! <laughs> Go down! You are free to leave. If you think you can run fast enough. But alternatively, we can go back and we can bust this place down. That guy right there looks like he's ready to get beat up. All of you have big weapons on you. Jeez, how are y'all just getting stuck back in your area? Well, have we killed everybody? Oh, jeez, come on, don't be a dick. Don't be a dick, that's what got everybody into this in the first place. Oh. Oh, really, you don't. 
Alright. Don't owe you a damn thing. I'm just gonna run off and get myself killed. Who will? That's fine. Everybody here now knows they can get away anytime we let them. Whoops. Sorry, lady. So, what are we going to do with this place? We don't quite know yet. We don't know if we've actually like found a leader or anything, but uh, we're going to check it out later. Uh, and uh, you'll get to see you next time. So if you liked what you saw, remember to leave a like and subscribe. If you haven't all, or if you have already left a like and subscribe, uh, go ahead and check out the description for all those awesome places to support us. And uh, yeah, well, leave a comment and stuff. Have a great night. Bye.